Hello my classy folks. It is Tuesday afternoon at 1 o'clock. Just heard the news that uh, this is getting harder and harder. That uh, two horses died in 24 hours at uh, Belmont and a horse died at Santa Anita that was going to run in one of the Breeders' Cup races. It's not clear the article from ESPN. I'll put down in the description. So, you know, do some research for me. I'm sure more news will come out. I just got this 20 minutes ago. And, of course, um, the news for the Breeders' Cup class is Arch Angelo is out. Had a, you know, pus or whatever in his back foot. So he's out. And I think Practical Move is out. I hope that's not the horse that had a fatality, I hope, right? Because he was going to be the favorite in the Breeders' Cup mile, okay? But, again, it seems like on our biggest days... It just sucks the excitement out of out of you know uh, us loving the races and wanting to see our equines uh, do well, of course, right? So again, uh, the article that I'm reading here that just posted uh, 55 minutes ago says horse dies, Belmont winner scratch from the Breeders' Cup Classic, a horse set to run in this week's weekend's Breeders' Cup died Tuesday at Santa Anita. That's what it says. A horse set to run in this weekend's Breeders' Cup died Tuesday at Santa Anita. And a short time later, Belmont Stakes winner Arch Angelo dropped out of the $6 million Classic. Goes on to talk about the trainer. We knew the horse had kicked the back of the stall or whatever, and he didn't recover very well. Practical Move was returning from morning gallop when he experienced a suspected cardiac uh, cardiac event. So may, did, did, did Practical Move die? A cardiac event? According to statements in the Breeders' Cup officials, his rider was not hurt. Veterinarians from California Horse Racing Board and First Racing and the Breeders' Cup 10 to the three-year-olds. Practical Move was clearly the three-to-one second choice for the one million dirt mile on Saturday. Did this horse die? Oh my God. So again, <laughs> uh, he had five wins. We know the career starts. Practical Move won the San Felipe Derby. But the point is, two horses died at Belmont in the last 24 hours back-to-back. Uh, Archangelo's out. I know Mage is not running, obviously, with whatever problem. And, of course, uh, you know, Go Rocky Ride is not doing really, really well after the surgery. Uh, thank God Echo Zulu's doing pretty good. But is, did Practical Move had a cardiac event? You know, a heart attack, basically. Uh, did this horse die? I mean, it, it doesn't really say it, say it, but the headline says it. Horse dies. Belmont winner scratch from Belmont Classic. A horse set to run in this weekend's Breeders' Cup died Tuesday at Santa Anita. Well, today is Tuesday. And this just came out 55 minutes ago. So again, Archangelo's out. It looks like a practical move had a cardiac arrest event or cardiac event. Mage is out, of course. We're down to a field of 11, which is besides the point. But it seems like on the biggest stage, we continue to get a black eye in the sport. And it just sucks the life out of the event, where you, you almost don't even want to watch it, you know? And it's so much work that we need to do here to channel to bring it. It's just such a downer. But hey, find out what you guys can find out, and girls, please, and let's comment, let's have classy discussion, and let's find out what kind of information we can find out about the two horses in Belmont, uh, Archangelo, and definitely practical move, right? It says horse die at Santa Anita on Tuesday. Man, it's just tough. It's just hard. And one of our viewers the other day said, Wayne, I don't even know if I'm going to watch the races, okay? I just might wait until it's all over, knowing nothing happened, and then maybe I'll go watch the races. And I kind of told him to watch, but, you know, maybe he's right, okay? Let's see what we can find out on this one, right? I'll put the article, the ESPN article, right under the description. You could just click on the link and read it. Y'all do some research. You know, I'm doing some other things and working. You're better at this than I am. All right, stay classy, y'all, and always tough for our sport.